bathroom. Oh, fuck. Bird offs herself to express her undying gratitude to you for saving her ass. I was, I was only gone an hour. Checked your pulse? She's gone. Gotta do something with her. Don't want any trouble. I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. I need to report an accidental death. North side, Jackson Street. No. No imminent danger. <laughs> Suicide. Tomorrow? No! Today! What part of dead don't you understand? No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. And fuck you. If you don't want to move your asses, why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? Fine. I don't give a fuck what you write me up for. <sighs> They'll be here soon. Told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? You know, to you, she was your best friend, so it's a terrible tragedy. But they must get dozens of calls like this every day. What are you? Their fucking PR rep? No, just saying. Put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. Did you wait outside? Close the door, V. Please. I'm a cig. Didn't know you smoked. <sighs> Quit. It's been years. But right now I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. <laughs> Here. That was her smoke case. Want to hold on to it? No. You seem to like it. Keep it. I'm kind of glad it's you that has it, actually. I gave her some t space, time, she'd get back on her feet. Stay strong, Judy. Don't let this tear you down. You know what? Let's just not say anything for a minute, okay?
Her condition couldn't think about anything else. Tech wise, she was clean. Dull Shard was operational, uncorrupted. So, psychological trauma had to be that. Did some more digging in her virtues, found the woodman. He kept her and had his way with her. The things he did. And once he got bored, he pawned her off. What did Woodman do to her? Did you see it? Yeah. And I really wish I could unsee it. I had no idea that guy was such a monster. I saw him as your average tricksy sleazebag. He puts on a convincing facade. I knew him, but I never thought him that sick. Gotta be something I can do about it. Like what? Don't know yet. Think I'll call Sue's. Thanks, V. Sorry, but uh, I'd rather be alone now. Promise to keep in touch. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow. 